Hello and welcome to this broadcast of this international friendly. Today it's England against Italy. A dull, dreary, wet day today. So without further ado, we're off to Wembley Stadium. Your commentary team is Clive Tilsley and Andy Townsend. It's an international football match and every time any of these players pull on their national jersey, it's a, an important game in their careers. This friendly is all part of the manager's master plan. And I think it's games like this, Clive, where the manager really has a look at one or two individuals trying to knit the perfect team together when it really matters. This was gone. Offside, I think. Not easy, you know, getting that offside right at the back, Clive. If you get it horribly wrong, it can cost you, but not there. That was a good decision. Rooney now. Are you a Wayne Rooney fan? Massive Rooney fan, Clive. So powerful and so important to his team. Jagielka gets to it first. Wembley is one of the most wanted names in world football, but since 2007 it's been a very different to the Wembley, the famous old Twin Towers. Now it's the 21st century Wembley under the spectacular arch. Clive, there could be few stadiums anywhere in the world that are better than this place. This is just an incredible footballing stadium. All we need now, I think, is some magical footballing nights. Let's hope we get one here. an accurate cross of a ball and they know it and that's why Clive he's got people committing to getting into that penalty area Gerard. this is Gary Cahill this is Rooney Gerard has an opportunity to get forward. He's not an easy man to mark, natural ball player. Just looking to get it clear. Used his head. Confident goalkeeping, didn't just stop it, held it. After time after time, Italy come into a tournament, we think they're nothing special. Next thing you know, they've won it. Why? How? I, I think what it, what's so good about the Italian team is they don't upset their own fans if they don't play good football. I think it doesn't matter how they do it, it's just getting across the line. And they seem to do that ever so well. On their day, capable of beating anything and anyone with some great football. But they can win ugly. They can do it a little bit nasty if they have to. They can mix it up, switch it round. They just have what's required to get over the line. It's a great, great mentality. There's a compliment in there somewhere, if you listen. Didn't take enough care with the pass, straight out. They have gone offside. Yes, he has. He is actually Cole. He will have the ball. One or two possibilities here. Johnson. It's a foul, no doubt about that, but will there be a card too? I think he thought he might get away with a warning, but it is a yellow. 
no complaints because he knew he was always struggling to make that challenge, Clive. There's the half-time whistle, and we're goalless. Ooh, Clive, that was hard oh, work to watch that opening 45 minutes. I can only hope it improves. I think I'd better go and get a cup of tea. So we Italy get this second half underway. Game that's still difficult to call. Defended well. first well back Wilshire a little bit of pressure building England asking questions refs allow the Italians the advantage Diamante you don't get past him too often not sure the men in the middle He's almost ball for choice here. Alberto Gilatino. Followed it. Managed to get in the way of it. Going for goal. Keeper got to it. Not clear though. This is Wayne Rooney. Jostling for possession. Determined defending. Giolini. the pass that Ashley Cole was looking for. Better Gilardino. Brown urging Italy forward. They're on the attack. He won that well. Now Cole. Returns it to him. Defender reacted quicker. played the advantage of. No problem there for me, Clive. The referee was correct. He produced the yellow card after trying to allow the play to develop. I'm afraid you just can't take that competitive edge out of Wayne Rooney. He will always commit himself to a challenge. He saw the chance to release him, but didn't direct the pass as he wanted. A free kick. Time for some fresh legs. A chance for the uh, substitute to go on and make a name for himself. Maybe win the game, who knows? Rather anxious clearance. Wilshire. He's not short of options here. Can't lose possession. Now Steven Gerrard Couldn't get past De Rossi Wilshire Diamante Daniele De Rossi
draws an opening. The whistle has gone, and we've got stalemate here. Nothing between them.